I'm going to play a game of solitaire for Hong Kong Mahjong. Because there are a lot of zero fun tables at Mahjong time, I'm going to force myself to play chicken hands. If you're new to Mahjong or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. That way you won't miss anything. All my tiles have been mixed and built into walls next to the risers. This way we can keep track of the progress of the game based on how many tiles are left for picking. I'm going to deal the tiles now. East will get 14 tiles, then Southwest and North will get 13 each. We'll look at each player's hand and see how we can get to a winning hand as quick as possible, even if it means playing chicken hands. Everybody has tiles. It is the East round. Let's look and see what we can do for East. Player one. Okay. They have enough tiles. Now, look at all these ones and nines. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine tiles from 13 orphans. Two pair. Ones and nines. Ones and nines. Chicken hand. Practice a chicken hand, not the biggest hand on the card. Don't go for the biggest hand on the card if you're trying to practice chicken hands. We need to go for the quickest win possible. I'm so tempted to play 13 orphans though. Look at that. All those tiles for 13 orphans. Ones and nines of each suit one of each wind and dragon and any tile paired. It's pretty light though with that, but maybe what we could do is a mixture of pungs and chows in different suits for a chicken hand, zero fun. So let's, we could do a chow, pung, pung, chow, one, two, three, four, All right, let's pick a tile to discard. Let's discard the honors and play a chicken hand. Zero fawn. Let's see what we can do for this player. Three flowers, two, three, four. This is player two, so we'll get score for that. But the hand itself, we'll try to get zero fawn. Four sets in a pair. Potential chow, potential chow, chow. Pair, chow, potential. One, two, three, four, five, all chow. That's one fawn. But let's go for it. Quickest win possible. They're just set up for chows. Flower, three flower, that's theirs. Chow, isolated, chow. Or two potential chows, isolated pair. One, two, three, four, we need more. Let's discard those. See if we can do all chow here. Four flower. That's their flower. Everybody's got great score for flowers. 
single honors. Half flush potential, one, two, three, pair of four, six, seven, single honors. I think I would discard these. So this player, maybe we could try four 13 orphans. I can't help myself. Let's just take it pick by pick and go for the quickest win possible. If that means 13 orphans, so be it. Although we were gonna chow there. All right. Oh, the struggle is real. It really is. Let's discard the South. No 13 orphans. We're going to play a chicken hand. So South, nobody can take it. We're going to draw. This is going to mark whose turn it is. Six dot. That can help with the chow. Maybe all chow. Let's discard the North. We're going to go for the quickest win possible because that's how people play at Mahjong time. Well, probably everywhere. Let's draw. Four crack. Okay, number tiles. Let's discard the East. Nine crack. Wow, look at that half flush. Let's get rid of the eight bam. South, we already discarded that. That would have been a good pair. They have, they would have had one, two, three pair. Okay, we're gonna draw. Six dot. Okay, now we have a pong. Five, seven, two, four, five, six, seven, pair, pair, isolated two, seven, eight, nine, potential. Let's discard the two crack. Up here, we already have a chow. Don't break a chow to make a chow. Although, if we did take that one, two, three, we would be left with a potential two, three, four. Let's go ahead and chow. If you break a chow to make a chow and it leaves you with a potential chow, that's okay. Chow. Red dragon. Nobody can take it. Nine dot. We'll discard that. Six bam. East was discarded. Four bam. Chow potential. Four, five, six, or five, six, seven, but this is a side weight. We could complete this with either a three bam or a six bam. Four, five, four, five, six. Five, six, seven, two, three, four. Let's get rid of the seven bam. Drawing. Six bam. They have a chow out. Potential chow isolated. Let's discard the seven crack. We got a chow right there. Potential chow or Potential chow, potential chow. These are isolated and a pair. We have one chow out, two, three, four, five blocks. We really don't even need those. You need five blocks. The blocks can be three in a sequence or three of a kind. So they're pretty well set here for now. So seven crack was discarded. We can't do anything with it here. Flower. north. Let's get rid of the five dot. Five dot. Nobody can take it. West. Oh, all those winds. Four, four. Okay. 
four dot four five two four four five six six seven pair or pawn pair uh, let's see here pair pong pair there's lots of chow potential here let's get rid of the nine crack I think we have too much going on in here we really don't need a seven eight nine edge chow nine crack nobody can take it we'll draw nine dot two dot nobody can take it red dragon wow these honors i think that 13 orphan hand was a good <laughs> potential winning hand eight dot wow let's see four four six okay pair isolated six seven eight six seven eight four five six potential potential let's discard the eight crack so they've had five discards five discards five discards here we go eight crack up here we can chow chow all those singles let's get rid of the six dot nobody can take it except this player might be able to we have a pair of fives six seven eight potential pung and then a bunch of potential chows i think with their potential here they have two potential chows right there I think I'd rather stay concealed. Let's draw. Nine bam. Okay, pair, pair, pair. Let's get rid of this green dragon. Three dot. Okay, pair, six, seven, eight, four, five, six, two three four ready to win a pair of fives chow 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 potential chow ready on a side weight three bam or six bam so that is ready to win in six discards that is a good goal ready to win in six discards on a side weight mix suit all chow hand six dot nobody can take it we are actually going into the middle game now a bam this is really set here we just need to chow and there's a pair they have a chow out four five or eight six eight either way or two three four let's get rid of the four dot and keep the eight because we do have a chow right there two three four four five six six seven eight let's discard the four dot drawing for north seven dot all these single honors are killing them let's draw I don't think anyone can take that. We need a three bam or a six bam here. Three crack. Okay, here. Seven, eight, one, two. Pair of nines, one, two, six bam. Everything else is blocked out. Even there. 
Let's get rid of the six man. Mahjong. And they have flowers, one of their own. So we have all chow. That's one fawn. All concealed is another fawn. They were completely concealed. Actually, they did win by, they, I think all concealed might mean that they have to self pick. No, because if they win by self draw, everybody pays double. They were fully concealed. So that's one fawn. All chow fully concealed is two fawn plus their flower, three fawn. Three fawn is eight points. So these two players would pay eight points. This player would pay double because they discarded it. So they would pay 16 points for a total of 32 points. That was a very quick game, ready to win in six discards, which is a really great goal. So all chow, fully concealed, and a flower, three fawn. That's decent score, actually. And they were ready to win in six discards by going with all chow. Now, player one really had a good chance at that 13 orphans but I was trying to force a chicken hand. That was kind of a mess. Then West was set. They had all their potential chows blocked out. North, half flesh, all those single honors, very painful. Single honors, I think that's the lesson learned here. Single honors are a hindrance in Hong Kong Mahjong, unless you're playing 13 Orphans. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click that little gray bell. That way you'll get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next solitaire for Hong Kong Mahjong, may all your picks be keepers.